this is rocket labs on the monthly chart and what you can see is support became resistance at the seven dollars and fifty cent level you could also see buyers defending the 350 to four dollar level you could also see support which is now resistance at the ten dollar level but the football playing field is between 750 and 375 scrolling down to the weekly chart you can see buyers bid up price into resistance which was support you could also see the selling wicks implying downside risk price is also respecting the short term weekly downtrend line so before we continue with the analysis let's look at this article kind of explains why the pullback in price at least this article is coming from the Motley Fool why Rocket Lab stock fell in August so Rocket Lab met analyst expectations for the fourth for the quarter but forecast a slower than expected next few months investors largely hit the eject button sending Rocket Lab shares down 14.4 percent for the month Rocket Lab is one of the handful of space stocks focused on delivering payloads to orbit. Unlike some of its rivals, the company has a track record of successful launches and steady revenue streams for investors to consider. Rocket Lab completed three successful launches in the quarter and also had at least 17 spacecrafts featuring company components deployed into space. But investors were more focused on what is to come. That's typically the case. It's all about the forward guidance. Rocket Lab forecast revenue of between 73 and 77 million in the current third quarter, which is short of consensus 82.38 million estimate heading into earnings season. That guidance sent Rocket Lab shares into the red after earnings, and the stock wasn't able to regain altitude as the month went on. Rocket Lab is on target to complete 15 launches this year and 20 in 2024, including six in the last three months of 2024. There has been a bit of a shakeout in the launch space of late, with Rocket Lab able to acquire the assets of rival Virgin Orbit out of bankruptcy in the quarter. With the company's track record of successful launches, investors should see some added pricing power in new contracts, allowing Rocket Lab to move forward profitability. Now space is complicated and Rocket Lab is investing heavily into new technologies including its neutron medium lift rocket. Investors who are intrigued by the opportunity should understand that Rocket Lab remains a speculative stock and there's a chance the company could flame out before it turns profitable. So where's price heading next? We do see a patch of resistance which is now serving as support a breach and a close today that band is going to become resistance once again let's go down to the daily chart and on the daily chart we're looking for high above average volume bars so I do like this pocket here and I'm gonna put that in blue signifying daily buyers 
So we had a rally in price, a couple of basin candles, then the rally out, taking out pivot highs to the left. Price came back, dipped its toes on the upper end of the zone, and then shot higher. Price attempted to come back to that zone again. Couldn't get there, so you know that the buyer's at their $5.20 level. You can see price is reacting again. So we're going to put daily buyers at 520. But this is not a level I would invest in. If you pull back to the weekly chart, that level is sitting right in the middle. So this area, we call that balance area between buyers and sellers. At the extremes, you have an imbalance between sellers and buyers and down below an imbalance between buyers and sellers. So if anything what's going to happen is potentially you get a, a short term pullback, fill that gap, retest the weekly downtrend line before moving lower. Now you do have this 200 day moving average, but the chart suggests price is going to retest the support level down in that $4 area. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Please like the video.